Today, I can announce a team of European doctors and nurses from Romania and another one from Norway to be deployed to Italy. We all know for some time that Italy has been struck by this virus particularly hard. We also remember that initially there was an inadequate response to the Italian request for assistance from other EU member states. But things have changed now, and the reality is that Italy is not alone. The reality is that Europe stands in solidarity with Italy. So through the European Union Civil Protection Mechanism, today these two medical teams are being dispatched to Bergamo and to Milano, two cities that have been hard hit by the outbreak. They are going there to help their Italian colleagues in their bitter fight against this outbreak. Next to this, I would also like to mention that Austria has offered over 3,000 liters of disinfectant to Italy, also via our civil protection mechanism. Our European Emergency Response Coordination Center has coordinated and co-financed this European assistance. It is working 24 hours, seven days a week, with all member states to make sure, to make sure that help is channeled to where there is most needs. Allow me to recall that ever since the virus has arrived to Europe, the Commission's number one priority has always been to save as many lives as possible. Obviously, this would not be, be possible without the dedicated medical staff who represent the true symbol of European solidarity. Therefore, I would like to thank today to Romania, to Norway, and to Austria for coming to Italy's support in a time that is so difficult, difficult for everyone, for the entire continent and the world. This is European Union solidarity in action.